Well, it may not be the senior year they were anticipating, but students across South Florida are making the most of their final days of high school. Some have gone above and beyond over the last four years, and we want to honor them. Tonight, we are shining a spotlight on senior Flora Rannis. One day, I'll have a daughter. And Flora Rannis is no stranger to the spotlight. As co-president of the National English Honor Society at American Heritage School in Plantation, she organized open mic nights and literary discussions. But that's not all. I was the vice president as well as the president of the National Honor Society. And through that club, we were able to do multiple things. I organized um, over five restaurant fundraisers, which we raised money for a peer of mine who's actually battling pancreatic cancer right now. And so basically trying to, you know, make a difference through that club. She served as an advocate for Teen Court of Broward County and volunteered with the Boys and Girls Club, logging more than 800 service hours as an underclassman. She was also in the Spanish and Science Honor Societies. Flora received the Outstanding Student Award in her senior year for her great grades and commitment to her community. But to me, I feel like it's not important just, you know, grades and things like that, but taking what I learned in the classroom and then expanding that into the community. And so, like, in my APES class, you know, learning about global warming and then seeing how can I affect that, you know, in the community. More than just studying for a test, how can I make a difference with this knowledge? And while wrapping up her high school experience from home wasn't part of the plan, Flora prefers to look at the bright side. It was always like the rainbow after the storm, and I think we kind of came together as class of 2020, and I feel like my friends and I kind of bonded over that, and I almost feel like our class is now stronger and more unified than ever. So I think there is that positive to it, which is really enjoyable to see. Flora plans to attend Yale University in the fall. She hasn't settled on a major just yet, but is interested in criminal justice as well as art and Spanish. She says as long as she's making a difference, she knows she will be happy. And I just love her attitude. She knows things didn't go exactly yeah. as planned, but they've gotten so many fun activities out of it, all these caravans and other things, so she likes it. <laughs> You know, what's great, she's been involved in so much in her high school years, she could go in any direction, mm -hmm. and she is going to uh, achieve so much. It's unlimited. That's CBS 4 News at 530. And here's what's next on CBS 4 News 